Hey guys, welcome back to No Catchy Name. It's me, Ella. Today is Tuesday, and I don't have time to record an actual episode. I've been super busy with my kids, but June is napping right now, so I am sitting in here. I'm cutting a little bit of fabric. I took a little clip of the table <laughs> to make some drawstring bags. Jesse's iPad screen got broken today. Big, big event, lots of tears. <laughs> um, so, and since it wasn't like in my normal budget, it's gonna be extra money coming out. So I'm going to make some drawstring bags to fund that. <laughs> so we found someone locally that can fix it for us and it's gonna be $90 to fix the screen on his iPad. So I'm going to make five drawstring bags <laughs> um, probably tomorrow and then I'm gonna put them in the shop <laughs> and hopefully they sell uh, quickly so that I can go take his iPad and drop it off and get it fixed for him because he uses it pretty much daily and he misses it and it was really sad. <laughs> but anyways, I just wanted to hop on here real quick and just show some things I've been crocheting. Haven't done much because I've been busy. <laughs> this weekend has been just really busy. But I did finish my plant doily. I did not weave in my ends yet, <laughs> but it's done. Um, I cannot remember what this is called off the top of my head. I think it's called um, Spicer Satch. It's called, uh, what is it called? Some kind of flower <laughs> um, doily. I'll, I'll link it below, but uh, I made it with yarns. I'm not sure what they are. They're Red Heart, I believe. Um, I have like half used skeins of these two yarns. But I finished that. And then I have been working on Jessie's little blanket rug. A little bit. It's with Bernat Blanket. Baby Blanket yarn. That's it so far. <laughs> this is called Cushy Rug. I'll link it below too. Uh, it's the same pattern I used for June's. It's just a different yarn. So I'm working on that slowly. Got about half the first ball in there. I have two cakes of this, so I probably will have to buy another cake or so. But that's a problem for a different day. <laughs> uh, and then I've also been working a little bit on my sweater. This is a paid for pattern that I bought. It is a crop top, but I think I'm actually gonna make it longer. Um, but I, I liked the shape of it and the puffy sleeves is why I bought it. It's only $4. But there it is. I'm working on it. <laughs> Getting there. Slowly but surely. I have not had any time to crochet. Been just really busy with the baby. And then this weekend was a holiday weekend here in the U.S. So I was just busy. And yeah, all these links, all these patterns will be linked below. And like I said, I'm going to be putting up just a few bags in my shop. Hopefully tomorrow. Probably Thursday. Because I'll be making them tomorrow. Um, it's just going to be like five or six drawstring bags. Just enough to fund paying for the um, person to fix Jesse's tablet screen. I messaged them already. They told me the price, which is $90. Um, and they told me that they have all the pieces already because all it is is a screen. It's not the actual tablet that got broke. It's just the screen got cracked really bad. It's spider webbed. Um, they have it there in their store. So they don't have to like order anything. I just have to take it there and they'll fix it for us. So that's good. And it's a lot cheaper than buying a new tablet. So I'm going to do that. I got that bag. These bags are going to be um three different prints this is one of them gonna be three different prints actually this i'm gonna put this one in the middle i think layered drawstring bags like that but you know they're gonna be draw the regular size um i'm just now cutting them these aren't even the right size yet uh i started cutting them and then sissy got upset you know grumpy needing a nap so now she's sleeping and i uh, thought i'd sit in here and record this video real quick and then cut some more fabric before she wakes up <laughs> but uh, and then I'll sell these bags tomorrow when Devin wakes up I'll I'll be able to whip them up really quick and then I'm keeping all my scrap pieces right here then I'm gonna make a um, I mean yeah, I got a little a little pile here of littler scraps that I'm gonna make like mosaic bags eventually with I'm just gonna hoard up a bunch of scraps and then sit down one day when June's napping <laughs> and uh, make a big piece of random fabric and then cut bags out of it is my plan Anyways, yeah, so I'm gonna hop off here and get this up for you guys to see. It's really quick, probably loud. Jesse's watching TV and the air's on. June's in there sleeping, so I'm like listening for her. <laughs> and um, yeah, I'm just gonna clean this stuff up. I made some jalapeno chicken for dinner today and uh, it was pretty good. I really want to make some sesame chicken, but I don't have any pan to deep fry stuff in. I don't have a deep fryer and I don't have any pans that I wanna fill with oil because it, you know, it always like get stuck on the pan so I, I told Devin I need to buy a pan just for deep frying stuff in because um you know you can make it with regular like pan seared chicken but it's just so much better when it's breaded and um or battered and fried <laughs> but anyways I'm gonna hop off here and get this up and I will see you guys tomorrow for what you're working on Wednesday hopefully if I get a chance to film it's just um 
some days are real hectic with the baby <laughs> so i'm gonna hop off here and i'll see you guys hopefully tomorrow and i will put up a video whenever i do get these bags done so if you want to check them out uh you can but i'm gonna hop off here and i'll see you guys later bye guys mm -hmm.